I believe your your motorcycle mama brought you to <laughs> brought you to Ireland on holidays when yes. you were in college. Do you have any Irish heritage? Obviously, the the red hair might yeah. give away, but uh, sadly, you know, I I know we do. Sadly, I wasn't as interested in um, searching for our, our ancestors as my grandmother was. I mean, we went to Dublin and then we went all the way over um, to the cliffs of um, Moher, Moher yeah. and on down Kinsale on oh, all wow. the way. Yeah, it was fabulous. And Trinity, is that? Trinity that, College. Yeah, yeah, where you go and that's where she did all of her research. That's right. So when yeah. she was doing that, I just thought it was very boring and yeah. I wasn't as <laughs> interested in it. But I'm that very. holiday. Yeah. <laughs> But I was really, it was one of my favorite trips I've ever been on. My grandmother is an incredible um, figure in my life and an influence in my life. And I, I really loved being in Ireland with her. I loved, loved, loved the movie. Absolutely mesmerizing performance. Thank you. Everything from, like, such a meaty role, everything from explaining the Nutella tax to that tongue twister of a line about Pollyannas. <laughs> How did you get your head around learning such a massive script? It's funny that line, the Pollyanna line, is, a, is something that I kept stumbling on when I was memorizing the dialogue. Every time I got to that line, I would like stop because uh, it was so wordy. What you have to do is you say the line over and over and over again, just kind of drilling it to the point that once you're on set, it just comes out and you don't even have to think about it. And you can move as fast as you have to for the character and you can do other things because you spent so much time um, memorizing your dialogue that it's second nature. Any advice for women trying to get that equality in the workplace? And I think um, we need to ask for what we need. Yeah. And for the longest time we felt like um, we didn't deserve it or that we were always going to be denied it yeah. even if we came forward and asked for something. When you come forward and, and tell your employer, um, do you realize that my coworker has less experience than me and he's getting paid more? When you Usually when you say that to an employer, they're like, are you, I had no idea. <laughs> you know, it's just yeah. a pattern that has happened in the workforce. So I guess I would just tell women to say what they need um, and they'll, they'll get it. Speak up and know your worth. Thank yeah. you so much, Jessica. That yeah, was a joy. You. Thank you very much. Uh, Pleasure.